Formation of ammonia. Ammonia is a highly toxic compound produced mainly by metabolism of amino acid and other nitrogenous compounds. Since amino acids have a short half-life, they are rapidly catabolized. The breakdown of amino acid may take place during fasting state as well as well-fed state. In well-fed state, the excess amino acid left over after body needs are fulfilled are catabolized. In addition ammonia is produced in the intestine by bacterial metabolism and also in kidney for maintenance of extracellular pH. Mechanism Inside the cell the amino acid which is undergoing transamination reaction gives its amino group to alpha-catoglutaric acid to form glutamate. These transamination reactions are catalyzed by special group of enzymes called aminotransferases. Pyritic sulfosphate act as its prosthetic group. Thus alpha-ketoglutaric acid takes up the ammonia from the amino acid undergoing transmination and gets converted to glutamate. Alanine is transaminated by alanine transaminus and aspartate by aspartate transaminus. Amino acid undergo transmination reaction because, it is this first step of catabolism of amino acid and ammonia is removed, and the carbon skeleton enters catabolic pathway. By means of transamination all non-essential amino acids can be synthesized by the body from keto acids available from other sources. Also transmination reaction helps in interconversion of amino acids. These glutamate molecules are transported to the liver. Inside the cells of almost all tissues the transamination of amino acid produces glutamic acid. But glutamine is the transport form of ammonia from brain and intestine to liver. Alanine is the transport form of ammonia from muscle to the liver. Final Disposal of Ammonia The ammonia from all over the body thus reaches liver as glutamate. The glutamate which reaches the liver is acted by the enzyme glutamate dehydrogenase which removes ammonia from glutamate. Also we know that the transport form of ammonia from brain and intestine is glutamine. So the glutamine which is transported to liver is acted by the enzyme glutaminus to remove ammonia. The alanine which carries ammonia from muscle undergo transamination in liver to form glutamate. This transamination is catalyzed by the enzyme alanine transaminus. This glutamate formed is acted upon by glutamate dehydrogenase to remove ammonia. Thus amino group of most amino acids is released by a coupled reaction. Transdemination which is transamination followed by oxidative demination. Transamination takes place inside a plasm of all cells of the body and amino group is transported to liver as glutamate or alanine or as glutamine which is finally oxidatively demonated in the mitochondria of hepatocytes. Thus, the components of reaction are physically far away, but physiologically they are coupled. The ammonia realized in liver is detoxified to urea in liver cells by urea cycle. Urea is considered to be the same ideal nitrogenous excretory product since it is highly soluble in water and hence large amount can be easily excreted. Also urea is non-toxic and inert. This urea is removed from body urine and sweat. The daily excretion of urea varies from 15 to 30 grams.